so you will have seen that I'm having a bit of a cook up today. I uh, had the Miss Squashes left over from Halloween uh, because it's a new me. I thought, come on, make some soup. So um, I'm going to give it a bash. I have no idea how it's going to work out, but I'm going to try. So um, I thought I'm going to drag you lot into it as well. And uh, I'll taste it at the end to let you know what it's like. Right, I have put a pan on and I've put uh, some olive oil, some chili flakes and uh, this garlicky thing that I found. Garlic. You always need garlic, don't you? So that's in. Uh, some onion that I've diced up and there's my carnival squash that I've diced up. So I'm going to stick the onions in first. Onions are in. I'm going to cook them. I'm just going to saute them. Get the squash crept in. Anyway, going to cook those uh, for a minute. Nice and low and slow. So they're nice and soft. And uh, I'm making this up as I go along. I mean, it's simple how hard can it be? Famous last words. I haven't got any potato, but I figure I don't really need it because I've got the squash. But I think I might put some red lentils in it. Might be the worst thing I've ever done, but I think I might do that to thicken it up. Found these in the cupboard. Uh, goodness knows how long I've had those. I don't think lentils go out of date, do they? I don't know. Anyway, I'll put them in here. This is David's uh, little sieve that he bought from one of the Chinese shops. I don't really know how many lentils to put in, so I've sort of just put a really, really large handful. And... Uh, I'm going to rinse them again i've got no evidence for this but i'm going to rinse them because i feel like that feels right squash is in david's banging about because he's trying to cook a pizza um anyway squash is in same i think just stir it around let it brew up cover it in all that nice olive oil might turn it up a bit anyway turned it up I need stock, I've realised. I've got two lots of stock. I've got this one, which is the best ever, and I make risotto with this. If anyone's found this in Spain, let me know, because I'm almost out. But I've also got these cubes that we've bought here, so I think I'm going to use the cubes rather than use up that one, because that's precious. But yeah, if, you've, if anyone's um, found it here, let me know. Right, that's been going for a little while. Lentils in. Giving it a mix. Oh, I love that sound. It actually smells really good. I don't know if that's enough lentil. I don't want to go too lentil mad. Uh, yeah, I'm going to leave it. I'll leave it at that. I'm putting vegetable stock in the soup, but also I found some coconut milk and I'm thinking that might be all right. Squash, lentil, chilli and coconut milk. I'm going to do it. I'm going to I'm going to give it a go. Right. That is smelling good. Sizzling away. I've made some stock. Didn't really look at how much water I was going to need. But anyway. So. Woo! Stock in. Give it a stir. Right. Coconut milk going in now. Coconut milk and chilli's got to go well, surely. Anyway. It's in. Don't know if I'm going to put the whole lot in. Hmm. Might just uh, might just leave it at that for a minute, let it cook, have a taste, see how we're getting on. Right, all in. Lid on. I'm going to leave it on low. I'm going to let it cook for a while, let it brew. Right. So I've blended it up and I've had a taste. It's the third tasting. I really don't like it. <laughs> Neither does David. 
I don't know why we don't, we just don't. It just tastes funky. It could be it's because it was a squash that we bought in Germany back in September. No, can't have been September. Was it September? Maybe the beginning of October. <laughs> October, I think. I don't know. But anyway, it isn't to my taste. But look, it looks all right. But mm. it looks nice. Maybe it's because we've just eaten a Twix. Maybe. I'm going to leave it. And I'm going to come back to it. Oh, it's late now. Sorry, it took me ages to get back to you. Busy day, sitting outside, drinking wine with Kat and Ewan. David leant on the table and it collapsed and it went everywhere and then beans at all the crisps. But anyway, so I've come in and I've reheated some of the soup. It's actually really nice. It must have been the Twix. Must have been eating chocolate before trying the soup because it's actually really nice. It is quite spicy. But I'm thinking a bit of creme fraiche or something and it might cool it off. I'm quite pleased with that. So yeah, all in all, a good soup day.